get this because the storms were coming, but to get two unanswered calls and then go home within an hour of getting to work seems a little odd. You'll see why I find this odd and many other people find this odd once we get to the little bit of suspects portion. Police came right out and did not find any evidence of a forced entry to the home, but they did find possible signs of a struggle. Fresh blood stains were found on the walls, carpet, and the bathroom counter. In the bathroom, it did look like somebody had tried to clean up some of the blood, but it's unknown what they tried to clean up this blood with. There was a trail of blood going down the hallway through the living room and to the back door. I'm not sure if this was the door that was found to be unlocked, but I'm assuming it was because it could have been the door to the garage and it just kind of lines up with everything. There was also blood and hair found on a door frame, so it's pretty clear that most likely Lee had her head hit onto a door frame, whether this was an accident